Hi, welcome all beautiful people to another episode of Lee Gaming featuring Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Link. Today I'm going to show you some live stream highlight from yesterday. If you are not willing to check out the two hours video from the live stream, be sure to check these highlights out. And remember to give a like, drop a comment down below and subscribe for more content. And follow me on my Facebook to have more updates and uploads information. So without further ado, let's go on to the deck. So the first deck that I'm um, featuring is e Messi Hero. And basically this is a elemental hero deck without a fusion card. So I have this three elemental hero new because I only have two of this UR and one of this UR. So these are the core of the cards. And I have only two elemental hero placement. If you can have three, it is better to have three. And you can remove one E hero hit to put another one in because I'm a free to play player. I just only have two. And I have one elemental hero necro shade. And its effect is that if it's in the graveyard, I can normal summon any level 5 higher monster to the field without tributing. So basically, you would like to use the braceman to mill out this guy first and followed by this tree guy so pathfinder to me up new space and its effect is to have my e hero monster or fusion monster to gain 500 attack and it has another effect that allows my fusion monster not to return to my extra deck e hero heat uh, this guy ha gains 200 attack for each e hero i control so with beat down i can easily overpower opponent I have 3 of these ground modes. So this card is kind of funky card because of its own effect as you can read on the left hand card. So this is also another call and with these 2 E hero nails, tribute to the doom just to destroy some front row if I need to and by discarding basically E hero nails, I can special summon with oversoul that I can target one he e hero non monster in my graveyard special target demo target and I have one righteous justice you only have one this guy is very useful as I can destroy any number of spell and trap equal to the number of e hero I control so basically you got the front row back row cover and new space as I mentioned earlier birthright just to special summon my e hero and for the extra deck, basically I will be using only this, the Elemental Hero Grow News, as it has its own special effect by special summon with the combination of E Hero News and Grow Most. So its effect is pretty OP. So once it's on the field, I can target one face up card my opponent control destroy the target then apply the effect based on this type so remember it's just a face up card so usually you would like to destroy a monster which means that this card cannot attack this turn so let's move on to the other deck type that I use which I had another video on it the fire brother hazy formation be sure to check out on this as it received high review during my live stream yesterday of its overpower ability so you can check on that for the introduction so just let's move on to the highlight of yesterday I will be featuring you the fire formation in the live stream yesterday because we are do we are doing viewers and I do not wish to accumulate anyone or embarrass anyone so I did it separately and capture some good highlights for you so this is for the E Hero Messi deck, which is kind of fun. So I open up with Hero. I started this deck in, I would say, by bare hands. I built it on the live stream yesterday, and I removed this Hero Bond because it's not really useful. So on this turn, I use the Pathfinder effect to me up new space for my field spell and use E Hero Braceman to mill up my level 7 monster and Gar Lizard return my Braceman to my hand. 
damn funky this guy so a direct attack by by king avatar i use my e hero again to why not just keep one milling up and attack him he destroyed my he destroyed phoenix that's why i did not set any spell and trap and he bit down me and you will say that gg you're gonna lose let's see what am i doing so I quickly set up 2 or 3 card, he bit down to 2700, I revived my e-hero nails from the grave and he tribute me. I have to special summon this, no choice. So I get my e-hero hit out just to do an attack and attack for the OTK. So basically this deck shows you the uh, ability of the summoning power so next is against a uh, weaver deck which i believe everyone is facing in the ladder now because of the additional lava golem so they are more tiered to this which is very irritating in my opinion but I will be doing uh, another burn deck later and it will be my last for I think the month because I doubt anyone loves to play burn deck so I get this up, he frag get me no biggie about that, I can tribute summon next turn which I did and he massive morphed me so basically he's waiting for his amazon I use the Oversoul, special summon my Hero Neil, bit down, he got a Bola, which everyone has one Bola nowadays. And I turn it to a special monster, he massive morph two of mine, he wasted two massive morph, and he just Xing Jang Hu my birthright, which is okay. Amazon Woman, got some damage to my side, and Oversoul for the OTK. But, wait, no, he did not do that. He gave me another chance, which is GG next turn. So this, this deck is pretty much straightforward. And bit down. There is one uh, video yesterday that I managed to special summon my fusion card. So you can just maybe just quickly glance through that video because sometimes your boy just was lazy to save highlights so that's why I always take extra time to make video for you guys because I'm always forgetful so now I'm featuring the fire brother hazy formation deck that I, that was used in the live stream yesterday and this guy is a monster with a bit with a balance skill and I just summon my Centaur. If you do have three Centaur, as I mentioned in my live stream yesterday, you can just use any three others fire high attack level four monster and below. So with this man it about my my hazy frame total neglects is effect, so he knows GG. Easy peasy. Because hazy frame effect is that it cannot be targeted by any cuts effect. So it's pretty good and with bit down you basically can overpower any, any heroes so far in this meta. So the last game is just a mirror match, a Roma Hazy against my bit down Hazy. And let's just see who has the last last love. So he got a Centaur with a, a face down cut. I use the fire formation Taksu effect to have another summon for my hazy frame and I just hide off the card with a monster bit down his bad roll can't even activate and that's it for him GG easy peasy like a cheesy alright I hope you guys enjoyed this video remember to follow me on my facebook subscribe to my channel as it is free no harm doing it and Enjoy and stay tuned for more videos coming up. 
Have a good day, good afternoon, good night, and signing off. Peace.